as uh, we meet with you here today, uh, we await language uh, on the resolution that the Democrats say they're going to put forward. Um, we would just note, and we're going to hear more on this issue from the Republican leader of the Rules Committee in just a minute, Mr. Cole. Um, but I would just note that what the Democrats are now trying to do, they've basically uh, cooked up a process they've been conducting in secret. The, the goal of the process, the aim of the process, uh, was very clearly to preclude the president's counsel from asking questions of witnesses. The goal of their process was to preclude uh, Republicans from being able to call any witnesses. Uh, and they've now taken this process, they've gotten so much pressure because of the way they've been conducting the process. They're now attempting to sort of put a cloak of legitimacy around this process uh, by saying they're going to bring it to a vote on the floor. They can't fix it. The process is broken. It's tainted. Uh, they have gone through this process where you have seen one side of the story. It's been an effort to get one side of facts and then to selectively leak those facts in order to taint the president. And we're not going to participate in, in helping them attempt to provide uh, legitimacy to that process. Democrats say you're moving the goalposts, that you've been demanding this vote, and now that it's happening, you say the process is still a sham. What's your reaction? No, I, I applaud the speaker for finally admitting it is a whole entire sham, but you can't put the genie back in the bottle. A due process starts at the beginning. It doesn't affirm a miss sham investigation all the way through. If you were in a legal term, it'd be the fruit from the poisonous tree. It'd be a mistrial. None of this, none of this information would go forward. But what's most important to the American public, we all have the phone call. We all have the transcript. We are all able to see there was no quid pro quo. The money was released, Ukraine did nothing, and no action was taken. Where's the crime? Where's the impeachment? And what's the impeachable offense? The American public sees that. We should move on, and they continue to try to move a whole sham organization. It's not going to work. 